Hello everybody, today we are going to be talking about how to start a career in sales. As a fresh graduate or experienced professional looking for how to start a career in the sales field, this series will explain to you what you need to know and how to get started. Sales is fundamental to every business and most businesses won't survive without a proper and effective sales department. Whether you want to be a salesperson or in any other career field, you need to fully understand the fundamental process of sales. Sales as a career field is fast growing and almost all companies require salespersons because many competitive products or services come up on a daily basis and they need the sales department to remain competitive. Sales is a very difficult field to automate because it requires a lot of human interaction. This makes it almost impossible to be fully replaced by robots. Automation in sales is more likely to replace tedious tasks that don't require the human touch in order to be executed to perfection. As a salesperson or aspiring sales professional, the ability to understand both technology and the human connection is what truly differentiates you from the rest. To first begin a career in sales, you need to understand what sales is about. Sales is a term used to describe the activities that lead to the selling of goods or services or the exchange of value for money. In simple terms, every activity we engage in to sell a good or service is described as sales. A sales professional is someone who sells products or services to potential customers. They bridge the gap between the customer's needs and the products or services that needs to be fulfilled. A sales professional handles the following in an organization. One, prospecting. Sometimes a salesperson is expected to identify potential customers or prospects and may be required to build an ideal client persona. This is more expected in business to business sales, where the sales professional may have to identify and qualify which enterprise or businesses could be good prospects to sell to. Two, lead conversions. Usually, companies generate leads, which is prospective customers, through their advertising or marketing efforts. After this process, it is the responsibility of a salesman or woman to deal with the already warmed up prospects and close the deal by introducing further information to encourage the customer to make the buying decision. Three, business growth. Sales professionals play an important role in the building of loyalty and trust between customers and businesses. During sales interactions, sales professionals can improve trust and loyalty by the way they relate with existing and potential customers. They can also encourage the customers to recommend and give a positive feedback, which can have a great impact on the growth of the business through increased brand awareness and sales. Trust and loyalty are the main reasons why a customer will choose or recommend a company to a friend or family member, or even write a great review of a product or service online. Customer retention and support. Sales professionals are usually the first point of contact for most companies. They receive and respond to customer complaints and resolve them as quickly and thoroughly as possible. Great salespeople are those that not only make the sale, but create a long-lasting impact on the customer. Long-term customer relationships lead to repeat customers, referrals, and increase the brand's reputation by word of mouth. Salespeople develop, implement, and track sales strategies and goals with different markets and sales modes. They create strategies to make sales with new and existing clients and also to expand the markets. They also collaborate with the marketing department to develop and implement inbound and outbound sales techniques. Also give feedback on the effectiveness of marketing campaigns, if any. They track and identify sales pattern with regards to the marketing effort, the type of customer, the mode of sale and product. Now you have an idea of some of the duties of the sales department in an organization. The next thing you need to know is the skills you need to succeed. Skills and tools to succeed in the sales career. 
One is effective communication. As a sales professional, you will be interacting with a lot of people in the course of your job. To succeed as a sales professional, you must know how to communicate effectively within your workplace and with our effective communication in the workplace course, you will learn how you can communicate with existing and prospective customers. Two, active listening. You should be able to listen to customers with a strict focus and ask intelligent follow-up questions. Great listening skills can help sales professionals empathize with prospects to learn more about their business and pain points. Three, product knowledge. You must learn to understand the product you sell, its value and the reason it appeals to your prospective customers. Four, strategic research and prospecting skills. Prospecting is a process of initiating and developing new businesses by searching for potential customers, clients or buyers for your products or services. You must know how to research and identify quality prospects with greater chances of converting them into revenue generating customers. Five, time management. As a salesperson, you have to learn how to effectively manage your time so that you don't end up wasting too much time on deals that are not profitable. With proper time management, you can reach more prospects and close more deals. Six, presentation skills. Presenting information clearly and effectively is a key skill to get your message or opinion across when interacting with potential customers. Presentation skills cover a large variety of areas, such as the structure and design of your presentation, the tone of your voice and your body language. Seven, basic computer skills. As a salesperson, you should be able to use the following word processing and data analysis packages, such as Microsoft Word. Microsoft Word is used heavily in the sales department. You use it to draft documents, such as proposals, training materials, and internal memos. Microsoft Excel. You use Excel to handle your sales reports, sales projections, and other documentation involving sales. Microsoft PowerPoint. While handling training and onboarding process, or when presenting proposals to prospects, you will use PowerPoints to create your presentation slides. CRM tools. To manage your prospects better and handle your sales activities, a proper understanding of how CRM tools work is essential. You also need training in sales to help you acquire the above skills and understand the art and science of selling, emotional intelligence, leadership, relating with customers, handling objections, and closing sales, and many more. The Strategic Sales Foundation course is a good place to start. Job prospects and earning in sales. Sales is like oxygen to most organizations. Demand for sales position will keep increasing. Sales professionals work in several industries, such as the financial industry, oil and gas, engineering, FMCG, education, constructing, health, real estate, and many more. Entry-level sales professionals in Nigeria earn between 50,000 and 150,000 monthly, while mid-level sales professionals earn between 175,000 and 450,000 monthly, and senior-level sales professionals earn over 450,000 naira monthly. Note that this does not cover the commission the salesperson gets, which can run into millions on a monthly basis. Whether you decide to start in a call center or in retail or in a commission-based position or a position with a base pay, you should try and start your career with a company that values your goods. Are certifications required to start a career in sales? Certifications are not required to start a career in sales. However, you can go further to acquire some certifications to help you progress your sales career and grow into senior roles. There are several sales certifications. Some of them are Institute of Sales and Marketing Management of Nigeria, ISMMN, Institute of Certified Sales Professionals, ICSP, Certified Professional Salesperson, CPSP, Certified Inside Sales Professional, CISP. 
Also, skilled sales professionals can potentially make more money than their unskilled peers. Our strategic sales foundation course equips you with the right selling skills from expert instructors. After the sales course, you will not only understand how to perform as a sales professional, but you will unlock the ability to earn far more than you do currently working as a skilled salesman or woman.